Hello everyone and welcome to the Women's Health Space YouTube channel, where we are all about empowering women with knowledge and insights on everything related to health and wellness. We appreciate your support and we're so excited to have you here. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and leave a comment below. We love hearing from you and we will respond to every comment. Today, we're going to dive into a super juicy and controversial topic. How to conceive a baby of a specific gender naturally. We know it's a hotly debated issue, but we're all about exploring all the possibilities and theories out there. Before we get into the nitty gritty, we want to clear something up. If you're looking for a surefire way to pick your baby's gender, the only scientifically proven method is through in vitro fertilization. But, if you're keen to go the natural route, there are a few theories and research studies we'll discuss in this video. Let's start with some science facts. A woman's egg contains two chromosomes, and they're both XX. That means a woman can only produce a baby girl. On the other hand, a man's sperm contains both X and Y chromosomes, with X being a girl and Y being a boy. So, when the sperm meets the egg, if the man's sperm carries a Y chromosome, it's a boy, and if it's X, it's a girl. In other words, it's the man who determines the baby's gender, not the woman. Unfortunately, there are cases where some men wrongly blame their wives for producing only one gender, leading to conflict in the family. But, it's important to know that gender selection is purely by chance, and the baby's sex depends on the man's sperm. Now, let's get into the fun stuff. Theories on how to enhance your chances of having a baby girl or boy. First up, we've got the ovulation method. To use this method, you need to know when you're ovulating. Once you've got that down, you can apply Dr. Landrum Shettles Brewer's theory, which highlights differences between male and female sperm. Dr. Brewer states that male sperm swims faster, is smaller in size, and survives for fewer days than female sperm. Using this theory, let's say your ovulation day is June 14, 2022. Your partner's sperm has five days to survive in the woman's womb. If you have sex five days before ovulation, the sperm may contain both boy and girl chromosomes. If you're after a baby girl, you can have sex four, three, and two days before ovulation, as girl sperm can survive for up to five days. Alternatively, if you're hoping for a baby boy, have sex on the day of ovulation or the day before, as boy sperm swims faster. Now, we've got some extra tips to help boost your chances of conceiving a specific gender. Tip number one, chow down on potassium and sodium rich foods. Studies have shown that a diet high in potassium and sodium can increase the odds of conceiving a male child. Yummy foods like bananas, sweet potatoes, spinach, and avocados are all great sources of potassium. Meanwhile, sodium-rich foods include cheese, cured meats, and pickles. But, be sure to consult with your doctor or a nutritionist before making any drastic changes to your diet. Tip number two, switch up your sex positions. Believe it or not, the position you're in during sex can play a role in your baby's gender. The missionary position is said to be more conducive to conceiving a boy, as it creates deeper penetration, allowing the sperm to be closer to the cervix. Meanwhile, the woman on top position is said to increase the chances of conceiving a girl, as the sperm has to swim further to reach the egg. Tip number three, timing is everything. Aside from the ovulation method, timing can also play a role in determining your baby's gender. Some theories suggest that having sex at night or in the afternoon can increase the chances of conceiving a boy, while having sex in the morning or early evening can increase the chances of conceiving a girl. And that's a wrap on our video on how to conceive a baby of a specific gender naturally. We hope you found this information helpful. Remember, at the end of the day, the most important thing is a healthy baby, regardless of their gender. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more informative content on women's health and wellness. Thanks for watching.